Hey guys, I've got a new update for Plains Monkey City, and it's awesome! It is finally, finally, finally some kind of free play aspect to the game, and we can finally make use of these awesome vengeful temples. Look at them! We've been able to build them before, but we've never been able to get use out of them just because, like, there was nothing actually strong enough for them to hand, like, to, to actually have a point. They were just completely useless, basically. Um, well, the amount of effort put into getting them really just wasn't worth it. But, um, we got free play now, round 167. This is in the Contested Territories update. I uh, probably should have started from the beginning there, but I might throw in some more of that after this. And, um, what this basically is, is the Contested Territories. You're thrown into, like, a group of people randomly picked, and, um, out of that group of people, you have to contest to see who can get to the highest round of, um, on that particular territory. It, uh, it changes, oh, it resets every day, and it also, at the end of the week, the person who spent the most time in the, like, in the top place in the territory wins the territory. And I believe you also get, like, cash and bloomstones for owning it. Um, there's also some new achievements, if I believe. I haven't actually looked through these properly, but, um, where is it? Um, if they're actually here. I don't know if they've been listed for me, but there is new achievements. I'll probably have to refresh or something to get those. But they're basically just for uh, stuff related to these territories. You have to capture a certain number of them. So, it's, um, finally free play. That's all I'm interested in. We finally get free play. I'm just going to play it mainly for that. Like, I'll get these. I'll try and get these achievements. And once I do, I'll probably keep doing this because it's fun. I mean, being able to use these guys is great. The only problem I have with it so far is that I think it seems a bit too easy. <laughs> I mean, it's definitely harder than Balloon's Tower Defense 5 free play, and there's some limitations you have to take into account, but other than that, it's fairly easy. I mean, uh, the, the balloons get stronger and faster a lot quicker, but these temples are very powerful. <laughs> but the one thing you do have to take, like, oh, I don't know if I've... I have taken this into account, but I don't know if it's really impacted me that much yet. It probably will. But we do have limitations in our towers now. And if you sacrifice something to a temple, then it's used up and you can't build another one. So I've like run out of apprentices because I sacrificed all them and yeah, <laughs> and stuff like that. So it's going to be interesting. It's not going to be all about just filling up the screen anymore. You're gonna, you're not gonna, you're probably not going to fill up the screen. Because, or you may, maybe you could, but you'd be filling it up with really horrible towers, so... <laughs> yeah. I can imagine this is going to be a very difficult thing to do on some of the maps which ban farms and stuff, but it's going to be very interesting. I'm looking forward to seeing how this progresses. So, hope you guys enjoyed this, and I'll see you around.